Hi traders, the first week of the new quarter ended in red. The S&P 500 index fell by 1.3% last week. The trade war between the US and China intensified and then came Friday's employment report which came short of expectations. Until recently, I believe that the market is expected to continue its declines due to technical reasons. But now it looks like the technical configuration combined with the fundamental economic concern may accelerate the declines. Now let's take a look at the technical formation of the market. When I take a look at the S&P 500 index, I can see the same triangle formation we've seen last week, but it, it intensifies now. And again, that is due again to a combination of technical analysis, as you can see here, nice technical formation for declines. And of course, uh, some fundamental data that came in last week, uh, the, the trade war and of course, uh, the employment report uh, that was published on Friday. So it looks like there's a better chance for declines, again, based on the technical view of the market. I want I want you also to take a look at uh, the VIX. Actually, this is the VXX, the ETF of, uh, uh, of the volatility index. And as you can see, it holds near the highs. The same highs that we experienced uh, on the big VIX move that happened on, on, on February declines. So it looks like that the fear factor is still in place. Uh, the volatility index is still high and it's probably gaining some power for the next uh, move. So if we're going to see the market coming down, the volatility index certainly is going to help because it still is at the high. So fear did not decline. Let's uh, take a look at last week picks. When I take a look at uh, last week uh, picks, actually a pick from two weeks ago, XRX Xerox finally came to the target. It was, uh, uh, we shorted the XRX and it came to the 3% target. So that was a nice trade. My second pick was uh, Juniper. Uh, Juniper did trigger, did not go much uh, down or up, still playing around the entry point. It still is in the game. And if the market is going to continue lower, I believe Juniper should continue declines. Uh, my last pick uh, last week was uh, Citigroup. Citigroup failed. It did trigger, came down, uh, moved up uh, on the short period. The market moved up and uh, I never lose more than 3%. So Citigroup is out. Let's have two picks for this week. My first pick for the week is REGN, a pharmaceutical company for short under $313.53. Nice technical formation for a breakdown, very clear declines. And again, if the market is going to continue, uh, companies who usually fail should continue to fail. So REGN is uh, expected to continue moving down. My second pick for the week is Weight Watchers, WTW for short under $60. A nice technical formation for a breakdown here in WTW. And again, if the market is going to continue down, uh, this should be a winner. I wish you a great trading week and I'll see you next week. Thank you for watching this video. Before you go, we invite you to take Traders free trading challenge. If you succeed, you will receive free trading education and access to a $14,000 funded trading account that will allow you to trade from home and keep 70% of your profits. Click here to sign up for this no risk, no cost offer. If you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel where you can view many more stock trading videos. Questions or comments, please submit them below.